Hey guys, today I'm going to install a backup camera into my car. Now I have a small car, it's a Prius C, so it's compact, uh, but the issue I have is at night my windows are tinted and I can't really see out the car, uh, so I always pray nobody's behind me when I come pulling out. So I'm going to install the camera, or the backup camera, uh, with the monitor. There's a few different ways to do it. The instructions come, I can do a wireless way to do it, or I can wire it. I'm going to see what's best and let's go take a look. Okay, so I got the camera on there and I got this cable I got to hide. I'm going to run it right up to this light here, but in order to get this light off so I can pop it in there, I've got to get inside the car uh, to pop it off. Okay, I got the light loose. I'm just going to string my cable up in there. Okay, so now I've got my, my cable ran and I've got my, my negative terminal. I just uh, soldered a O-ring for electrical and then drilled it into the uh, body of the Prius. I like to put these little ends on my power um, so I can just plug it into one of these terminals. Now I've checked all of these terminals to make sure uh, to see which one's off and which one's on. Now lots of people you, you want to hook it hook the power up to your rear lights. Well I want the option to look at my camera at any given time not necessarily when I'm in reverse. So what I did is I, I uh, soldered this on, cleaned it up nice. And I'm just going to go through these and see which one turns on, uh, which one makes my device work. Now how I know is this blue light turns on. So if I disconnect the power, the light's off. So I'm looking for which one of these will turn on because I want power on all the time, not just with the light. So it looks like I have a few options. Uh, I'm just going to randomly pick one. I could not find a wiring diagram for my model of Prius or for any for that matter without free uh, so I just thought I'd do this trial and error I do know this is off when the car is not running it is on right now I'm gonna turn the car off and just verify that again before I tidy everything up and make it permanent okay my power lights off so I know that this terminal is only on when the car power when the car's power is on I don't want it on all the time because I'll drain my battery I just want it on when the car is running uh, so I'm going to just turn the car back on, make sure my power is good, and I'm going to tie it up here nice and tidy. This will all be hidden behind the panel, so I'm not too worried about how it looks, but I want the cables nice and secure so they don't pop out. Okay, so I get it up here nice and tight. That's not going to come out. My power light's still on because my car's on and running. I try to. You want to try and make sure these are good and tight wherever you put them so you don't rattle because you don't want to add any noise into your car. So I'm probably going to put one more wire tie there. I'm going to button up the panel and go to the other side. Okay, I'm all done here. You can see I got my camera. The wire goes up nicely. It's not going to leak. Let's go check out the front. Now right now I just opted for the cigarette lighter plug-in. I'm going to ultimately change that to a more permanent solution where you can't see the wiring. Um, trying to decide where I want to put the camera. Uh, put the. I'm trying to decide where I want to put it. I'll probably stick it right here. So I can see it, but you can see the camera works. I'm gonna turn the car off. And you see the camera went off uh, with the power of the car. I'll go ahead and kick it back on. And camera's back on. I, I like the always on so I can see what's going on behind me without looking uh, through my tinted windows. Overall, the project was easy. Uh, it wasn't hard to install. It just takes a little bit of time. I like to solder all my end my ends and then uh, put heat shrink on them so I don't have to worry about any arcing or electrical shorting. Uh, so that takes me a little bit of time. Uh, I still need to wire it so it's a little more permanent and I can free up my cigarette lighter for uh, other things. I currently have my, my uh, dash cam plugged into it. Uh, so I'll either split it or just make it permanent. Uh, right now I'm just going to test it out for a bit and uh, see how I like it and make sure it's where I want it. Uh, anyways, happy driving, safe driving, and have fun.